What's up guys, today is Monday. That means it's Joe's All-Star Tool Monday. There he is, there's the car. So that means his truck's still broke. So let's see what he's got, come on. Joe Cool here. Well, you know, the sun's just bright, but you know, <laughs> I, I never make that claim anyway, but. Uh, you are cool, Joe. It, it was. Last you know, week it was sure enough cool. <laughs> it wasn't cool last week. It was downright cold. Yeah. Bitter, bitter cold. But. Uh, Reminds was, you of Wisconsin. As I was saying, we were uh, hibernating all week and no, I hibernating like bears, but no, I wasn't a bear or bear fan. I'm a Packer fan. We got that straight. But uh, yeah, it was cold. Got that extra vacation. Um, Did it remind you of Wisconsin? No, because we would have been working through it. <laughs> Everybody would have been working through that. It was only like you know three inches of ice and three you know three six inches of snow on top of it, yeah. and you know just work like every other day. No, not here. No, yeah. so no. It was rough. And, no, you know, the good thing was no plow trucks, no salt trucks down by us. I told my wife, I says, hey, it's perfect. There's no salt, no chemicals on our car. It's just dirty. Yep. But uh, so that's good. I hope everybody's safe and nobody's got $17,000 heating bills, too. Ooh. That's outrageous. There mm. should be a law against that. Should be a law against a lot of stuff, but <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're not going to go there too far. But I am going to. I'm just going to show these out one more time because I have been having the most fun showing these everywhere and I got to talk to my good buddy that sent me these and yep. when he when he first told me he was going to send me something for my truck I, I first asked him if it was a big pile of C4 and he said they didn't sell that on Amazon so <laughs> you know have to do we, some tenure we laughed out. about that but uh, anyways out. so before we get too far, I do got a couple things to show you. I got a couple uh, dollars for the bucket of cash to catch up on. As it, you see, it's working its way up there. We're going to start with Mr. Corey Jenkins. What a great guy. I'm just going to leave it right there. Great guy, Corey Jenkins. We haven't mentioned him, but we got him here. Everybody else follow suit, but we got uh, Sam Cook. We got Junior Switcher. We have Mr. John Van Hoos. We got Mr. Walter. We got John Hamlin, another great guy. You know, this guy actually came from way up north too. Long, long really? much longer than I have. He got lost. He he actually uh, sounds and people accept him be uh, one of them southern people. We have Mr. Kim Hammond. We have Mr. Leo Martin. Now he came from Florida. I don't know what he's doing around these parts, but <laughs> I'll stay in Florida. Florida. And we have two for Mr. Eric Warren. There you go. Another great guy. So what's the scoop on the truck? We scoop ever on the tow truck? truck back well, let or? me tell you. I know they did nothing on my truck last week. And, you know, I'm not, uh, nobody did nothing last week anywhere around here. Um, <clears throat> they put my truck together three times. Torque converter, bad. Brand new torque converters from Ford, all three times, bad. So, I got nothing to say about it. I was looking for C4, didn't get it. I'm waiting I don't for see it. how how they're getting three bad torque converters in a row. That don't oh, make any sense. I know these guys are calling, talking to Ford about it, about my truck, because the guy says, Joe, he says, I want to get your truck done. He says, I'm, I'm getting way too good at taking your truck apart, putting it together. I want to get it to you, but... He says, every time we go, we go to put it, 
put it on the wheels and go on the drive and it don't go nowhere. <laughs> he says, Joe, if I was you, when they got that piece of shit fixed, I'd call me a rollback. Just I'd let them tight. drag it up on it. I'd tow it to some place. I'd have the, like, you know, maybe a block away, have the rollback, let it off the truck. I'd drive it into the place I wanted to, you know, trade it in. I'd be like, here it is. It's done. Oh, well, it'll be three weeks before we get your truck, you know, in that you ordered. Okay, just I'm going to go ahead and leave mine here. Y'all have it cleaned up. Maybe I'll sell it by the time the new one comes in. There's no way in hell there, I'd drive that thing. There is something, yep. Yeah. Something to be said for that. I am working on a couple of things. I am. I hope so. I, You'd be better off with a minivan. I'm telling you. <laughs> Pocket pry bars. Now, I know I got an awful lot out there. If um, I didn't get to everybody, do let me know. $6. I've gotten pretty good at sending these out pretty cheap. Um, if I missed anybody, let me know too. Six bucks. They're pretty cheap on shipping. I've been getting them all over the place. Got all a bunch right. of them. I just keep reloading my pocket. Load them up. Slow them up. Now, for the painters. I got the uh, face mask with the respirators all together. Mm -hmm. I got them, I think it's like 33.50. Okay. So I got a couple, I got a few of these in here. I got a couple up front. So we got these here. Them will work for painters or meth cooks, whichever one you want to use it for. Well, you know, we, Are we, you can, we were saying that painters, you know, paint and meth. Uh, you can you paint know. and then cook meth. There you go. Keep your lungs healthy. Uh, we have talked about these before. They're uh, quarter inch heads, but they're made for the three eighths. They're three eighths they're bodies three -eighths with uh, in a quarter inch right, hat. Quarter inch head. There you go. So it's like a stubby, 90 teeth. So they're fine too, 100 bucks for the pair. 100 bucks. Can't Long it. reach, get in fine places. There you go. I have four. I know you're going to see it. I was going to text you, but I might as well just show you. Did you get my impact back? Uh-oh, must not have got it back. Oh, we got we to talk to see where, where I'm at on where I'm at. But, Mr. Bob Bartz, I got these here in for you. Uh, we're waiting for these two to come in. Okay. And I got your sockets, which I will be shipping all out together for you tomorrow. Cool. So, I got that all thing here for you. Uh, they, they got shipped to me right before... I started my uh, bear hibernation. Hybrid, <laughs> hibernation. Yeah, hibernation. Um, I got all kinds of stream lights, um, gear wrench, whatever you want to need. I'm going to have something to do as far as gear wrench coming out uh, tomorrow. I mean, next week, that is tomorrow. I was telling people, yeah. I was here yesterday, but that was two weeks ago. That was my <laughs> yesterday. It all depends on, you know, hibernation time. That's it. But uh, y'all keep safe. Keep good one. Keep things going. We'll talk later on the flip side. There you go. All right, guys. Like always, if you need anything from Mr. Joe, his number is 731-412-7295. Shoot him a text. Best way to get, get a hold of him, and he'll take care of you from there. But like always, guys, if you like the video, hit the thumbs up. It don't cost you nothing to hit the thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, punch that button. Just press the button right there. That's all you got to do. Just click that button. You guys have a great week, and we will catch you next time. See ya.